Back in March of 2020, New York City was the epicenter of the coronavirus pandemic. And in Manhattan's Chinatown, community members experienced it twice over, not just with the disruptions caused by the virus, but with the racism and xenophobia that surfaced alongside it, sometimes manifesting in violence. It was an incredibly difficult year for this mostly immigrant community, but a new movement emerged among the younger generation, first and second generation Asian Americans who rallied around a newfound pride in their culture and their heritage and used social media to amplify their message. This is the story of Chinatown, Generation Next. It's the dinner rush at Wohop Restaurant in New York City, and the cooks are busy prepping customer favorites like General Tso's chicken and beef lo mein. In this tiny basement eatery, the experience is definitely no frills. Photos and dollar bills covering nearly every inch of wall space serve as evidence of just how much New Yorkers love Wohop, said to be Chinatown's second oldest restaurant. David Leung is the majority owner of Wohop. His grandfather and father worked here for decades after immigrating to America. But Leung says he was never involved. I always knew that my father went to, to work uh, late at night, and I rarely saw him. He didn't bring his work home with him. I really didn't know what he did. Um, we rarely even went to the restaurant. About 10 years ago, Leung learned just how big of a role his father played at Wohop. I always thought he maybe was just uh, a manager. I didn't know that we actually owned the restaurant. For many children of immigrants, there's an unspoken understanding that parents toil and sacrifice to provide their children with a life that's better than theirs. He wanted his kids to just go to school, study, get good grades, that's it, you know, and not be burdened by anything else. But achieving the so-called American dream can sometimes distance first-generation Americans, like Leung, from their cultural identity, making it that much harder to pass down values and traditions to their kids. It's hard because everyone around them is also benefiting from the American lifestyle. My parents used to tell me, oh, we can't afford this, or we can't afford that. And I can't really say that to my kids now without lying. Wohop has given Leung and his children a way to reconnect with their roots. His daughter Chelsea runs the restaurant's Instagram account and designs its t-shirts. And Leung's son Mitchell helps run the restaurant's Facebook account. We get so many reviews on TripAdvisor, Yelp, and Google. And so many of them would say, I've been coming to you for 20 years, 30 years. My father first brought me here. My grandfather you know, first brought me here. For Leung, running Wohop is not only a family tradition, but also a homecoming. 